Mike Zegers. Football, that's it. He roofs that right under the post. And Zegers has another to make it 5 nothing. Into the very top bin of the net. Turcotte will find Zegers again. Really nice move with his skates as he gets up on his edges to lose the defenseman off the head of the goaltender and in. Krebs again holds the line. It's taken down, drops it off for Zeri. Canada changing. Zeri drops it back to Byram, fresh off the bench. Byram slides off the boards along Risha Kinnison. Rebound, score! Peyton Krebs, and it's three, nothing Canada. If there's a player that's deserved one, it's Peyton Krebs. He is, we have talked about him all game long, all over the front of the net, all over the puck. Has had a couple of chances that haven't gone. Gord, we often talk about the, the second period and the long change defensively. What also happens is the offensive players can change, so they're fresh. Canada gets players off the bench, Krebs and Byram in particular. Byram walks the line, this shot is Deflected twice, it hits Krebs in the pants, and then he shoots it between his own legs past Pirinen, and Canada stretched this out to a 3 0 lead. Mirov hangs it off the end boards. Who's the Dinov waiting for it? Who's the Dinov citizen? Puck calls it back door pass, they score! Amirov from Puck calls it a power play goal. Russia's back on top. But Colson's going to make a slick play by the goal line and head up as soon as he turns. Nice play by Huznadinov to put Colson. Look at his head up the whole time. And Amirov's shot is almost stopped by Volstad, but and he's helping the goaltender or helping the the officials out as his goal will count. That shot flows wide from. Chinahov and Muhammad Ullin did a good job to keep it alive for a moment. Now, Grilowski gets around him. Grilowski busts in, drops it back, oh. scores! <laughs> Philip Koffer! What a play he makes. Muhammad Ullin keeps the puck in at the blue line. They've been on the ice for well over a minute and 20 seconds. He races down the ice, and this pass is perfect on the tape to Koffer. And he pounds it into the net. Philip Koffer's first of the tournament. Out of his own zone. We'll send this in. Albert Johansson, a Detroit pick. There's in for you, Stan. Score! Lucas Raymond will find the back of the net. Great feed. Jimmy Waite took in one of the greatest goaltending performances in a single game in Canadian history. Oh, what a dash here by Ferrard moving in and scores! Rick Ferrard down the right side. Makes it an eight goal, USA lead. In the middle of the ice, the more with the opportunity on the forehand with more net to look at rather than closing it down. Stutzla, Buster, oh. Stutzla. 4.23 in Edmonton, which just means it's Stutzla time. <laughs> Unbelievable. He breaks. Watch the lower body leverage. He gets underneath Fiedler, and he never loses sight of the puck. You talk about being able to operate in tight corners. Tim Stutzla. Oh, boy. Is he going to be an exciting player to watch in Ottawa? Terrific hands in tight. Yes. Finland one for three in the opening game on the power play. 0 for one here in this one. Carson and backhander scores! What a backhander. And what a shot on the backhand. Well, there's two more games after this one. Let's see if another player could come up with a better one than that beauty. Full flight, and the puck just skipped away from Caulfield. Back for Zegras. Zegras for Boldy. Boldy scores! 
pulls it back between his legs and stuffs it. Well, Caulfield gets it up high, and then this is a great move. I love the way that Boldy's above the goal line there and receives the pass, and then, I mean, he's a big, powerful forward. You're not getting through him to the puck. This season was slow going. He had a foot injury in October. So he's just kind of getting over that. Shot score! Right there. Talk about his foot. There's pretty good hands. Well, wasn't able to sneak it through the legs of Malik, but here he is here. Nice play by Soderstrom to give it to him in a really good spot. No mistake on that goal. That Such is a, a beauty. Raymond on the power play, plays it for Soderblom, scores! Second goal that Big Elmer Soderblom has scored in that fashion. I was asked if he has a chance to play in the NHL. Yeah, he does. He's got a real good chance to play in the NHL because he's just continuously progressed. Raymond a little fake, moves everybody around, and then feeds Soderblom, where Soderblom gets the puck on the move and then pulls it in front between the legs, up and over the shoulder off the block.